hello in this video we are going to see how to control a three axis gantry in simulation software by using a soft plc here we can see in my screen the simulation software and the simulation model of a gantry axis here and this is the soft plc the tia portal uh, running in the guest machine that is virtual VMware in in my case so first step is to connect the OPC UA channel with KIP server running in the host machine so I'll go to server and edit connection and I have used this one here so just checking this again when you press enter you will see if it finds a server it will populate the URL here then you click on this then this loads here test connection connection succeeded apply and then I connect it to the cap server and then the cap server is running here and there are a couple of variables uh, tags defined in the cap server so if we go here and I press show variables here we can see the variables which will be communicating in between the simulation software and the Siemens PLC okay and we are connected here with the cap server and then the cap server is running fine so the next step is to go into the guest machine so we'll go here and we have to this is the program just to give an overview of the program how it works here we have the main block and then the main block is calling this function which is 500 select job command so if I go with the five this function so this is the main function which is calling all the other functions the program is basically very simple uh, user have options uh, four different options uh, one two four uh, in integer values he can put and if in the value of the variable trigger jog is one so it will go to one position the three axis gantry I mean and the values two it will go to another position and same for three and four and these positions have been defined in these structures so you can see some values here so based on the input values the gantry axis will move to these locations and this one I'm using to uh, demonstrate a move relative function of the Siemens technology object here basically there is one function called move apps, apps job so what does it do Let's go in so it actually moves the axis using the move absolute uh, function from the Siemens technology objects which is here so in this function I am using this one and same way in this function I am using the Siemens technology motion control and move relative okay so let's compile this program I will run the simulation It's loading once it's loaded we have to press the start search and it finds the PLC sim press load press load again and then we have to start the module and press finish so PLC sim has started let's go to the data block and here we will go online 
and we will turn this one on so we can monitor the variables and the program is running after this what we need to do here is the net to plc sim add a server here this is the vmware ip address and select one and this is the siemens plc sim ip address you can see here this one and this one we would select this one and press ok and then start server okay so we are all connected now so i will minimize this virtual machine and let's go to our simulation software and what happens when i press run okay as you can see that in my case the access start was already selected on and the option was selected one here so the axis is moving to that location and here you can see the values are calculated from the PLC program okay okay now what happens when if I select two for this trigger job variable it will go to the location which I have set in the PLC program and just to demonstrate a relative move function I select four and it will move only one axis to minus 100 relatively okay Thanks for watching the demo.